I would just say as an exercise science and athletic training department, we are never limiting ourselves to what we have today. My goal as a department chair is to look for new avenues for education, look for new opportunities, look for new great students, and accepting those students into a department that is thriving and growing every single day. The exercise science concentration is built for students who come into Manchester University to basically get um, the prerequisites done for graduate school. The students in fitness and recreation concentration are coming to Manchester because they have an interest in things like coaching, fitness clubs, as well as becoming certified strength conditioning specialists. I want to go to physical therapy school, so uh, they've done a great job at helping me prepare and stay focused and make sure I'm hitting all the prerequisites and the steps along the way. I play football here, so my main drive to become exercise science was to partially be a coach because coaches have had a big influence on my life and I'd like to have that influence on others. I've been able to communicate with professors and find out what career path would be best for me and how to set myself up, not only with just education, but getting to know people and make connections in order to be successful and find a good job in the future. The athletic training degree is built to have undergraduate students come in as first year students, graduate in four years, and then turn around and take the board of certification exam. And so they get a lot of hands-on experience, they get a lot of clinical duties, they work with the athletic teams um, on campus with preceptors, with their other athletic trainers that are certified, um, as well as going out to the community to get a huge array of different experiences clinically. One of my favorite classes probably so far would be first year clinical. It's where we learn how to tape and all the different techniques and how to prevent injuries and how to heal injuries as well. Yeah, my first tape job was awful, but the more I do it, the better it gets. I feel like that's the only way to actually get good at what you want to do as a profession. I got to um, be the student athletic trainer for the men's soccer team this past fall, which was an amazing experience. So we're not waiting until we graduate to get that hands-on experience. And the last major is physical education. Physical education is housed in our department. Um, it is ran by Dr. Kim Duchesne. The part that Manchester prides itself on is uh, we take that academic work and we actually get to apply it before they go out into the public schools. Uh, I teach the teachers and then the teachers teach the students and that's where the practice comes in. I have been a part of a pep session which is when we have homeschool kids from the community come in. We basically act as a physical education teacher for them. PEP helped me prepare because they're students at all different levels and so I think it just shows you how to um, be flexible in your lesson plans. It builds my confidence being in the teaching lab because I was so nervous the very first time I had to stand up in front of the kids and it just has just having like my classmates around me to support me has really helped me to build my confidence in that. The goal for us is to get these students hitting the ground running. All right, I want my students in athletic training, and exercise science, and physical education to get the practical experience so that they understand that when they go out to the job market, they know exactly what to do. So we are preparing these students with the coursework and the hands-on clinical experiences to be able to make them better than the next person. We also are trying to prepare them to become selfless students, not only in the profession they are, but to become good stewards of the university and to be good stewards in the community. We need to continue that tradition and that's when Manchester University and that is when and how this department is going to continue to grow.